Hey everyone, uh, welcome back to Lucky Corners with uh, the workers and resources in the Soviet Republic. So I've been messing around with a little bit of stuff down here. Uh, and also, uh, way up here, we have Iron Town, right? Which is uh, slowly getting stuff going. Now, someone pointed out that uh, I really should have the heating plant up here and a storage uh, which brings the uh, the coal into the heating plant and the uh, uh, steel mill right uh, and that is uh, entirely uh, logical and uh, normally I would be all over that however uh, I put some thought into it, and while the suggestion is absolutely excellent, uh, so uh, if you're doing stuff yourself, um, you know it's it's a, a a really good way to do things. I want to. There's two things that I want to do. I want to make sure that the uh, heating plant doesn't run out of coal, and I know from experience a couple of trucks can keep it supplied pretty well. And uh, I want to keep the pipe runs shorter. Uh, now, uh, from here, uh, if I bring up the uh, underground, I've got a pipe run up to here. Uh, and I'd need a pipe run all the way up to here to heat this stuff. If any of it actually needs heating, I can't remember. Um, and... Uh, yeah, uh, and that's a pretty long run, and I'd probably need a uh, a, a heat pump in there, uh, or like a, a heat water pump. But with this down here, it's also closer to the uh, residences. So uh, now my concern is that if I just put a storage up here, now let me just get a. Uh, uh, conveyor up here uh, so we can see where the inputs are if I was to put the put a, a storage up here right and uh, have the uh, the uh, coal unload into that uh, then I could uh, run a uh, conveyor uh, into a heating plant right and uh, into the uh, steel mill and that would uh, that would allow uh, one drop-off point for uh, both of those now I'm not actually going to do that now uh, the reason for that is uh, I, I don't want the uh, steel plant to take all the coal which it could do easily if it's connected to an iron mine right uh, and, uh, uh, you know, like I could have put the, uh, steel mill down here, uh, with the, uh, where the coal is and, uh, bring the, the iron to that, uh, cause it's, uh, uh, it's about seven to four, uh, for coal to iron. If I recall when I was looking at the math. And uh, that would use up the coal uh, pretty quick. But having the coal transported and having a separate city here to provide the labor for all of that, because this thing takes a lot of labor as well at full tilt, uh, it gives a uh, pretty, it gives me a, a control on the uh, coal consumption. Uh, and that, that's, the, that's my goal there. I'm actually trying to slow the production down a bit. Um, so, uh, I'm actually going to leave things the way they are, uh, and, uh, I'll, uh, just run maybe some trucks up from the coal down there. Although, yeah, probably. 
Yeah. So anyway, that that's my uh, that's my thinking on that, right? So, uh, and I'm not trying to min max either, right? So that makes uh, something of a difference as well. Uh, now, I also had the excellent suggestion from uh, uh, I think the same commenter that I should get the choppers in operation building some of this stuff here that's uh, not connected by roads. And that, too, is uh, a perfectly good suggestion. I do have a reason I haven't done that yet, and it's this. I want to clear the, the loans uh, before I start uh, uh, running through a large number of rubles for steel imports and so on uh because that's what's going to happen right uh, if i uh, uh, start getting the choppers bringing the material up here uh, i want to avoid that just yet that's not to say that uh, I, I i won't uh, enable that at some point but it is it is something that i'm intentionally delaying now I can go ahead here and uh, pay off some of these. No, I want this to stay at 50k. Um, right, really. Uh, we can pay off a bunch of these uh, little loans here. Right? Uh, because there's uh, some uh, cash coming in, right? Uh, Okay, so that uh, that's down to one page of loans, right? Uh, so, and that yeah, that cut the monthly expenses quite a bit. So if we get three hundred k in a month, we're gonna have this paid off in uh, well by the end of this summer, uh, realistically. Uh, also, the uh, what is this? Oh, it's grain, right? Okay. Um, now, what stuff up here do I need to get built quickly? Well, you know, I'm going... I said I wasn't going to do it, but I'm actually going to. Uh, apologies if you can hear the air conditioning. Uh, it just kicked in. Uh, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab the, uh, the chopper stuff and... Uh, at least get the technical services and the heating plant I think underway yeah uh, because those can definitely get uh, get get constructed uh, nicely this needs that one can get people uh, yeah Okay. Yeah, the choppers will uh, will you know be bringing stuff in here, get stuff uh, uh, built. Uh, you know, we're making our own fuel, uh, right? I I believe yes, we are up here. So since we're making our own fuel, uh, we don't have to worry about the cost of uh, running anything that uses fuel, right? Um, let's make sure that one is, yeah. You know what? Let's uh, put the choppers on that one too. Yeah, uh, so basically here, uh, we've got roads being constructed, right? Uh, and we've got, uh, yeah, oh, the warehouse is uh, also uh, constructed here. Uh, so what do I want to store up here in the, uh, in the warehouse, right? Well, I'm going to want food. Uh, we're going to limit the amounts. So we're going to want food. Uh, probably... Probably go half food, uh, clothes, 
Yeah. Uh, we'll want electronics in there. No, maybe not quite that much. Yeah. Okay, so electronics, food, and clothes. What else do we want up here? Uh, I'll probably end up wanting chemicals at some point. Um, yeah. So, so I want more of the clothes than the electronics. Um, and we'll zero these guys out. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I think I think that's an okay balance on that. Now, I wonder if if a uh, train uh, distribution office can keep that stocked uh, from from customs for the moment, I guess. Um, now here, that would need boxcars? That would need boxcars, I think. So, uh, however we slice them, I'm going to need boxcars. So, that's cargo wagons. Um, covered hull. So that's food, clothes, and electronics. Yep. Uh, yeah? So if I put, say, three of those in there. Yeah. And then I can go in and... Where's the depot? Here. Yeah. Uh, yep. We'll launch that. Okay. Yep, we've got our three box cars. Okay. And then here, at the customs house, I'm going to pause this while I do that. We're going to allow loading clothes, food, and electronics. Yeah. Okay, and then we're going to add an unload. Um, plus, and we'll add an unload up here, right? It's going to be an unload, and it's going to be these guys. Yep, and we're going to unload if it's less than... 90% or 100%? 90%, I think. Okay. Okay. Now, if we come down here, I think that's going to send a train out right away. Pretty quickly. I think it should, anyway. Yep. Now, what's it going to do? It's going to load food. Okay. So let's uh, let's just uh, follow this guy. Let's first person it. Just for uh, giggles, right? Hello, autosave. Yep. Um, yeah. Nice. So now we uh, load up 
uh, a bunch of uh, food. And off we go. Okay. We loaded 61 tons of food. Oh, because we ran out of money. Okay. Right. Well, that's fine. Uh, yeah, the money will keep going up. So ultimately, oh, we're just going to drop off some coal, so that'll definitely uh, bump it up a little bit. Uh, what's with the pause? Oh, what? Oh. Oh, I see. It's the track builder. Um, yeah, okay. Right. Right, I have the single track sections here. That, that'll be fine. Uh, I'm not overly worried about the single track uh, sections uh, uh, causing a bottleneck. Um, you know, they are fairly long. Uh, might be useful to have another passing track in here. Yeah, it might. But mostly the trains are going to run at about the same speed, so... Um, hmm. Okay. Yeah, okay, well, it's fine. I can, I can tweak that later, right? Now, over here... Ah, right. Oh, I should... Uh, no, I want to watch this, bef and then I'll go over there and do the I should thing. Um, oh, yeah, that guy's got to come out of the way. No, I'll... Uh, Grab this, grab this, and uh, add this, and this, yep. Then that's pretty much all the track. Yeah, I'm going to need to... Uh huh. Right. What? Right. Okay. Yeah. So now in here we have some food. Right. Well, that can be bringing stuff in in the background. That'll be fine. Okay. Um, well, I'm going to need a regular signal there, a chain signal there, chain signal there, and a regular one here, and a regular one here, and a chain here. Right, okay. Then I'll need a chain here and a regular one here. Yeah. And then 
up here. Aha. Uh -huh. A regular one on here and here and a chain here. Yep. Yeah. And a chain here and a chain here. And a regular one. And a mixed. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Probably going to have to rejig this at some point, but uh, I'll deal with that uh, when the time comes. Okay, those are built. What's this? Water loading, sewage loading. Right. You can build those. Yep. Okay. Ah. I'm also going to need a mixed signal here, right? Yeah. Okay. I need some more signals there, but I'm going to uh, sort that out uh, separately. Um, Oh, yeah, I've got another train load of stuff going up there. Um, bringing clothes up. Okay. Right. Let's, um, let's actually do this. Turn the uh, interface off. We can get a clean view of this, right? You know, this isn't so bad. Chopper arriving. Neat. And in we go. Whee! And out we go. Whee! And we'll just take a ride back. <clears throat> Great. Well... Yeah, that track, uh, I'm reasonably happy with that. I mean, there's, uh, you know, probably better ways to do it, but, you yeah, know, I'm reasonably happy with it. Okay, now what are we... Oh! We're loading electronics and clothes. Neat. You know, I do kind of like these uh, rail distribution offices. Uh, they give a, a nice uh, automated railroad operation going on, right? Which is quite, uh, quite a great way to uh, create uh, traffic on your railroads without having to make a bajillion lines, right? Right, okay. Well, I'm going to stop following that. Uh, right. So this is just going to keep doing what it's doing until the uh, warehouse is uh, filled up. Uh, you know what? I think 
another passing point along this long run right about here is uh, probably a reasonable thing to stick in so I will uh, set one up here yeah okay now I can grab the thing the thing yeah and I can assign that right okay uh, that has okay uh, yep I can put a couple more signals in there so this is going to be a regular signal here no pointing that way yep okay yeah uh, that's gonna be that um, where's the where's the Dewey uh, the constructor that's uh, that's what it is uh, oh it's there okay uh, meanwhile let's uh, come down here uh, we've built this piece of bridge uh, we need to build that one and we need to also build this yep okay oh and this is uh, filled up as well okay so yeah we still got 189 with nowhere to live that's fine uh, we got 79% health, 75% happy. Uh, I can I can live with that. Yeah, where can we get from there? What's this? That's a police station with no police cars. Uh, why don't we buy? Well, we'll need to have some cash before we can do that. Yeah. Um, yeah, we'll use these ones. Yeah. Seems like the ones to use. Yeah, we just need the uh, the excitement that is export to uh, actually kick up into high gear, and um, okay. Let's grab one police car while we can. Okay, that's all of them. Okay. Um, and you are a fire station. Yep. Okay. Now, oh, let's check in on the other police operation. Where is it? I have one somewhere. Here? No. Where did I put it? That secret police. Hospital. Ah, it's a small police station. Yeah, it's getting overloaded, so having some cars here uh, should allow it to clear some of the uh, cases from elsewhere should improve the happiness as well
Uh, unable to get food. Oh. Yeah, that would be a problem, wouldn't it? Uh, yeah, you got to pay attention to these things. Uh, so if I go in here, and just for uh, giggles, I grab one of those. Hopefully, that sorts out the uh, food shortage. Yeah, I think that probably will help with that. Okay. So we have food being delivered now uh, there. And while well, there was food there, okay. Yeah, I think it'll take a minute for that to catch up. Uh, just waiting for the uh, deliveries to arrive, right? Because we've got nothing on the... what? Oh yeah, because it'd be coming here. Food supply. I should probably put a second truck on the food supply on that one. Yeah, probably. Yeah, so that's a KMZ 5410, right? Okay. So we go up. Where's the... Where'd I put the depot? No. No. Where did did I put the depot? No. Oh. Oh, well that guy's full. So yeah. Um Yeah, do that. Oh, uh, let's just make sure we don't run out of cash. And I want a covered hull, right? Um, one of those. Okay. Okay. Uh, I can close that guy. And look here, yeah. Okay. Right, okay. Now, you are going where? Um, for a customs trip. Okay, good. Now, where is this one? Oh, it's just about there. Okay. Okay, so we put eight tons of food in there, which will disappear in a hurry. Right? Uh, with the second one, we might be able to keep up once the pent demand um, eases, right? Um, but we still got too many that can't get food and uh, Population is going down because of uh, 
you know, the guy in charge of logistics being an idiot. Yeah. Uh, funny how that works, isn't it? Um, where's this one at? Oh, it's, uh, it's coming. So, if it gets there before the full uh, amount goes away, which it's going to, yep. Okay, so those are going to ping pong back and forth for a while. Uh, that should reverse the health and uh, happiness effects over time, uh, right? So, uh, hopefully that's a uh, net improvement. Okay, there's another truck coming. It's uh, unloading food. Okay, yeah, I think the, uh, the food shortage down there is, sh is uh, sorted out now. Uh, okay, so here, uh, this number should keep going down. Yeah. The unable to get food number should be going going down now. Good. Uh, right. Well, it's a good thing I was almost paying attention, because that uh, caught that a little bit faster than I would have uh, normally. Uh, now, up here... How close to filled up is everything here? Um, what's in here? Uh, oh, it's the rest, most of the rest of the food. Okay. Okay, well, it'll bring some food and some, uh, let's see how, how much of what it brings next time. Uh, let's, uh, let's check in over here on the economy uh, tab. Uh, yeah, these, while well, they're uh, a lot cheaper in interest uh, it costs quite a bit to uh, to run those uh, loans down for that half a year right uh, question is whether uh, we can survive that for uh, for the time period that's necessary Definitely something to uh, consider, right? Um, definitely observe here the... Uh, uh, we're going to be exporting some uh, uh, coal, is it? Yeah. How's this doing? Well, it's accumulating. Okay. Yeah. Okay, what are we uh, grabbing here? Uh, okay, uh, I'm just going to grab one more of these so that, because it's an expensive thing that's, uh, that it's loading, right? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I think that's the last of the expensive stuff that it needs to load up. Okay. Yeah, we got a 480k rubles worth of uh, stuff in there, right? So that's coming up to here. Um, right. Ah, oh, yes, and we're building the uh, rail there. Ah. 
Okay, this has been uh, constructed, so uh, so I don't forget. I will put the signaling on here. Okay, so that's one more passing place along there. I think that'll keep the traffic jams down. Oh, and that's finished. Okay, and this one's on paving. Okay. Yeah, this is just about going to be done. Okay, good. Now here, 77, 40, yep, those are full. And... I think that's it. I don't think it'll send out another train. Yeah, I don't think it's going to. Well, uh, I'm gonna put the I'm gonna put the cut in uh, about here. Uh, I had expected to uh, do a time lapse or something to bring things forward, but no, I uh, I ended up uh, doing something different. Right? Uh, well, anyway, uh, that's how these things go. Uh, Next time around, uh, hopefully get more of Iron Town underway because I really need to get steel production going. Uh, so I'll uh, I'll get that uh, a little little more underway, and uh, from there uh, we'll see what happens. Uh, as I said, I'm not going to move the heating plant or the uh, or change the coal loading operation or unloading operation just at the moment. Uh, uh, I might actually uh, change change the coal unloading to a uh, a uh, station or something, but uh, I need to get everything built up there first, and then uh, figure out what I'm going to do. Anyway, uh, that's going to be all for this episode. So I do have a Patreon. I'll mention uh, if for some bizarre reason you feel like you want to support the channel. Well, the link will be in the description, and you can uh, dig it up that way. Um, if you're not interested in supporting the channel, well then don't. You know, it's uh, your money, right? Do what you will with it. Uh, and uh, yeah, uh, I guess all that said, see you back next time.